Hello everyone and welcome back. Today I'm going to be sharing my authentic Puerto Rican coquito recipe with you guys. Okay, the ingredients is cream of coconut, evaporated milk, coconut milk, sweetened condensed milk, cinnamon sticks, pure vanilla extract, cloves, ground nutmeg, and that's the cloves I'm showing you right there, ground cinnamon, star anise, and of course, rum bacardi, clear, preferably. Uh, it's really, it's your choice, what kind of alcohol you'd like to use, but we use rum bacardi, one-on-one. Who can guess what's going to go on here? Yeah. We're going to be making some coquito. First thing we're going to start off with is um some water. What are you going to add first? Cloves. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Got some cloves in there. Now the next thing I'm going to do is... Some nutmeg. It's going to be smelling amazing in here in a minute. Let me see what's that. What you got, honey? Star anise. After the star anise, you throw in some cinnamon sticks. And once it comes to a boil, it's going to change color, lovely amber color. And then you let it cool down, and then we'll take it from there. We have our delicious tea on the stovetop. We're going to move on to the cream of coconut, coconut milk, evaporated milk, and sweetened condensed milk to make the second part of the coquito. It smells so good in here. Now I'm gonna start with the evaporated milk and it's one of my favorites. I love evaporated milk. The creaminess, the way it smells, the way it tastes. It's delicious. Can't go wrong with evaporated milk. Now up next is the coconut milk. I hope you try this recipe. It's delicious. It's foolproof. Ah, look how smooth that is. Silky smooth. Now cream of coconut. One of my favorite parts. <laughs> that is delicious. That is very thick. Cream of coconut. All those flavors combined together. You'll be thanking me later if you try this recipe. Sweetened condensed milk. Okay, babe. You're gonna need the spoon for this. Oh, I got it right there ready. Okay. I love this one for that because you know we always. Uh, <clears throat> mm-hmm. Oh yeah. <laughs> <the picture. laughs> oh yeah, we do. We're dippers. <laughs> It's creamy. Oh my it's goodness. Sweet. Yes. And it's delicious. Yes, it is. Wow. This is where you get all that flavor. Sweetness. Yes. Sweetness and flavor, you're right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I am not mad right now. I am very happy. You're making me happiness with all this goodness. Wow. Yeah, Ribbons thanks. of deliciousness. <laughs> I'm sorry, baby. Now I'm going to add the vanilla extract. And now hubby's adding ground cinnamon. And we're about to move on to the next step. Here he's whisking everything together just to combine a little bit. Getting everything ready for the next step. Which will be the blender. Get everything in the blender. Now, this is the final step before we introduce the tea into the mixture. Everything's looking good. That's that beautiful amber color I was talking about. That's what we're looking for. That is ready. Here we go. There goes the tea. 
Looking and smelling good. Gonna whisk the tea in. You see little specks, I don't know if you guys can see them. But that's from the spices and that color. So pretty. Lovely. So pretty that color is. Oh, what do you got going over here? Uh oh. oh. Not the pasteles. <laughs> yeah, baby. Got everything going. This is Rum Bacardi Clear, and that is what we use for one batch. We ended up making two batches, one virgin and one with alcohol, and the virgin is so delicious. Um, but yeah, that's half a pint. For, <laughs> it looks like a lot of mixture, but you can taste the Bacardi, definitely. But trust me, especially if you're not a drinker like we are, yeah, you're going to taste it. And you have to combine that really well once you introduce the alcohol to the mixture you have to mix it very well so we're going to do the taste test salud salud whoa okay <laughs> good i think it's perfect i told you oh my you can taste the zing 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 yeah but it's not overdone it's perfect it's perfect just right i think it's just right Wow, you can taste that Bacardi for sure. That was good. Yes. Well, we are all done with this batch. And this is the batch that contains the Bacardi rum, the clear Bacardi rum. The next batch will be virgin, which means it will contain no alcohol at all. And it's only because some of us like it with alcohol and some of us don't. Personal preference. Well, that is it. That is how we make authentic Puerto Rican coquito. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching. And if you did, please subscribe. Hit the like button. Comment. Hit the notification bell. And um, yeah, until next time, God willing, may you all continue to stay blessed, beautiful, and ciao.